Auntie Penny Snuggles loves the new toy. The one with the stick. The one where you can win. But she's not really concerned about winning. No one else is around, so the ball is literally in her court. Even though there is no ball. And her mom has no shirt. <laughs> it's so goddamn hot in here. Metal tubes were not made for anyone to live in that don't want to sweat to death. And if you're 64, ventilation is key. I have only two windows that have fans in. So we're doing the best we can. We're trying to survive. And pretty soon someone will wander in here and wonder what she has. No one has, and no one is sleeping with me. So that'll be a clue for Mr. Black, who thinks he is. His hot, long hair is not going anywhere near my hot, no-shirt body. I will eventually put on a shirt, but because I don't think that I should wander around my own home without a shirt. So, anyway... See how much she loves this thing? She is madly in love with it. I had to bring it back here before I could take the tags off because this is where my scissors are. See how much she loves it? Auntie Penny is just the best. And people that came from... Uh, I can't... It had something to do with five. Uh... It's like a Dollar Tree, only most of the things are $5. I want to go back, but I want to wait till fall, because today was ungodly. It was 98 in Waterville. Uh, I'm sorry, Waterloo. Waterville is over by where I'm from, God's country, the pretty part of Iowa. She is Maine Coon. She is three years old this month, she and her sisters. Uh, Lady and Precious and Sadie are three years old. She says she's never seen anything in her entire life so gosh darn great, Auntie Penny. And oh, it just about went into her cold water. There wasn't any water in there. All the kitty food is gone in here. They must have just hung out at Mom's house while Mom was gone. I don't know why. There's a little breeze right now, but there wasn't anything when I came in. But then I had clothes. I had all my clothes on. So, thank you, Auntie Penny. We'll try out the other toy when we see Chester. They're having, I got chicken, a whole chicken at the food bank. And better check your chicken because my frozen chicken is going into the crock pot tomorrow morning early. Because it's thawed. It is thawed. We're going to eat it anyway because it's a nice chicken. But it's thawed. It's in the refrigerator. So, check your chicken. I gotta get up early and get the rest of my stuff in and out of the car. I had the best time, Penny. Thank you, great spirit, for sending this great woman to me in the parking lot. Oh, look, she got the prize! She got the prize out. Isn't that cool? And we'll stick the prize back in. Penny explained to me that cats are sort of like children. Well, I think cats are children, but um, they have to win sometimes. So when they pull on a thing and 
they get the thing, it's like tug of war, and then they find the toy, they win. She's she's just a baby, so she doesn't do jumping around and for sure and the things like that. In fact, oh, she discovered it, okay. I'm surprised she doesn't just run away with that. Teddy would. Teddy would put it in her mouth and run for it. And leave everybody else looking like, <laughs> you can have the thing on the stick because that is just not as good as this thing. I don't know. She likes it. I haven't seen anyone else come in. Sophie is on the washing machine. She likes it because it feels cool on her tummy. Hi, Sophie. Sophie is in September. She'll be two, two. She was born in September of 220. I'm thinking that their mom is three. And I really, except for, uh, I got black at 205, so... And Chester is only four months, so anyway, this is almost too much fun. It's just hard to park. I'll take this way. I'll put that over there. Oh, there's a breeze. There you go. Isn't she pretty? Isn't she just the prettiest in kitty in here? And I don't have my glasses on. She looks sort of like a blob, but she's beautiful. I caught her on a live trap last year. Her sister, Precious, was found under a trailer by the neighbor. She's just so pretty. I think I, well, I thought she was pregnant because she had gotten out with the kitty we tried to save, a white Calico. We think maybe she might have had her kittens by now. We don't know. If you find a white calico, her name is Snowball. She lives at 21 Quasquetan Trailer Park. It's the only trailer with a covered porch in the trailer park. Opposite the, the only big building that is... Uh, what not building. I don't really know what it is, but there's things in it, and we're going to call it the what not building. So, I'm going to attach that thing. Let's take a check. Check it. Check it out. Look, it is like a little mousy thing. Isn't that cool? A little mousy thing. Five Below. Is that the name of the store, Penny? Five Below? Five and below. Five and below, I think. Anyway, it was a great store. And they have headphones if we can get jobs that actually are work at home. You know, people say they're out there. We need them. So, have a blessed evening. This is still Saturday night. The sky was beautiful and red this, this evening. 98 in Waterloo. I don't know what it was here at home, Quas Greeton. So this is Val's uh, White Wolf Books, Quas Greeton. I sell on Pango. Have a blessed evening. This is from Snuggles, Heike. We're going to give her a wonderful middle name. Snuggles Penny Heike. She didn't have a middle name. Now she has a good one. Good night. Good night, all.